All right, um, I got a couple a uh, couple people asking how I cleared uh, 22 by 12s or how bad do 20 by tw uh, 22 by 12s rub on a uh, leveled uh, F-150. Um, but before I start, uh, I can't believe I, I got over like 20,000 views on that last video. That's crazy. You know, there's quite a few people hating in it, but you know what? I really don't care. But anyway, um, uh, pretty much, well, like I said, it is leveled, so it's got a two-inch uh, leveling kit in there. Um, the bumper is actually off of a, a two-wheel drive sport, so the valence bar is a little bit different. The, I mean, the valence, the plastic down here, it doesn't obviously doesn't have a bottom uh, valence, um, but this little plastic uh, had to be trimmed uh, a little bit, you know, kind of going back at an angle, um, which it clears it by plenty now. You can't tell. There is no, my bumper, my actual bumper is not cut any, any which way. Um, it doesn't rub that whatsoever, but the, 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 uh, sorry, I'm not paying attention to the camera. The, uh, the plastic is trimmed and then the back of the wheel well. Oh, I, oh, also at the front, my crash bar. Uh, the crash bar is completely cut out. I just, uh, just, just pretty much whacked it out of there. Um, or else it will rub the crash bar pretty, pretty good. Um, you can, I guess, get like a bender and bend the bend the crash bars, but there was no. It was easier just to just to cut it out. I guess I could have unbolted it and pulled it out, but I, you know, once again, I just don't care. I cut it out. Um, I didn't cut the back one out. It doesn't rub the back one, so the back one is still in there. Uh, the carpet, however, is getting a little chewed up because it does rub on the carpet. You could cut this, I guess, at an angle or what? Oh shit! I almost dropped my phone here. Uh, you can uh, cut it at an angle and, and get it to clear. But um, uh, obviously the back has no problems. Um, that should be self-explanatory. Um, so there are 22 by 12s, negative 44 offset. Let me just run around to the other side and show you pretty much the same thing here. Um, uh, you can see here, no crash bar. Cut the crash bar out again. Bumpers trimmed a bit, uh, just about the same. Uh, not much carpet rubbing on this side, a little bit. Uh, full lock which this is you know just fabric it's not going to do absolutely anything uh you know to the wheel or, or anything like that once again bumper is not cut i did not seem to beaver the shit out of it and uh that's it pretty much it is it's very doable 22 by 12 is negative 44 offset on a two inch leveling kit not hard to uh, accomplish at all with just a little bit of uh uh trimming and uh and and, and removing the crash bars and you you can do the crash bars a little bit cleaner by I guess unbolting them. Um, I did look at unbolting them, but they're like oh, welded. The bolts are welded uh, on the bottom. So the only way to take them off is like pull this carpet down and, and unbolt them from up here, which I guess wouldn't be too hard, but I just cut them out. It's, it doesn't really uh, change anything. Um, taking them out rather than just cutting them took just as long to cut them as it would have done to undo the two bolts. So. Uh, that's that. That's pretty much all I did to clear uh, 22 by 12s on a leveled F-150. Uh, you know, if you guys watch the rest of them or the, any of the other videos, it's a 2015. So I know some of you guys might think that's important, but uh, pretty much from the 20, I guess 15 and up, this is going to be about the same thing. I, my uh, my dad just get it. My dad just bought himself a new uh, uh, 2019. So. Um, there might, we might do a video on level. I'm going to level that for him, uh, put a leveling kit on that, and then he's doing 20 by 10s um, on some uh, 33, 12 and a half uh, Federal Caraja, the MTs. But uh, that's it. Um, had to clear 20 by 12s on a 2015 F-150, 2015 plus. Uh, we know whatever you have. So that's it.